Archives has had just about everything used to make exhibits that draw praise, criticism, and attention. But organizers say for the first time in the history of the competition, there will be art made from blood. 24 News 8's Barton Dieters talked with the artist who decided to create some startling pieces. Barton? Well, Marley, Bob Long runs a meat processing business in LaGrange, Indiana, and he wanted to take on a hobby, so he decided to use the material he had at hand. In this case, buckets of blood. I went to Hobby Lobby, got a canvas, and the next day at work I saved a bucket of blood, and I sat down at the picnic table outside the shop and put my hands in the blood and just started putting it on there and just, it just took off from there. The 49-year-old butcher says he has made more than 70 paintings. It's all finger painting. I don't use any brushes or sponges or nothing. It's just my body and the canvas and the blood. That's what it is. Long said he uses buckets of blood and says he feels like it is a way of respecting the animals and letting none of it go to waste. He says he's used to the smell and uses a buddy's car shop to clear coat the paintings. Long was a, raised in a home with two preachers as parents and said he feels like the inspiration flows through him. I think of God a lot when I'm painting. It's like, I wonder about God, you know? And then I think about space, outer space out there. And, uh, like, what's really way, way after it? Long's work is seen at Brothers Leather Company on South Division Avenue. A leather shop? I mean, that's awesome, you know, a leather shop. That goes right along with what I do. It's just how I do it. And this year, I just work the blood back and forth until it looks like a banana. One of the blood paintings is part of a show down the street at the Harris Building, running through Sunday, that features past and present art prize contestants, along with internationally renowned fine artists. It's hanging right next to an Arthur Dove, an extremely famous artist. There was no explanation of how Long's paintings were made. The guy's a, a butcher. He runs a slaughterhouse, oh and so he uses... Just... I mean, this could be any kind. This could be oil, because... It's animal blood. Is it? Yeah. Okay. I almost said blood, and I'm like, that's a little, that's a little far-fetched. You can see the strength of what he's doing that transcends the blood factor, which is interesting, but it is, it's secondary to what he's making with the blood. Earlier, I talked to animal rights activists, and they say they are concerned, but they're not available for an on-camera interview tonight. There, now there are links on woodtv.com about where to find Long's work, and there you can judge for yourself whether it's great art or just bloody awful. In studio, Barton Dieters, 24-hour News 8.